Hello, hello, Salaya here and welcome to the next episode of uh, Mountain Blade Warband 2. In this episode I'm going to continue rolling to the Red Empire, to Galadians and see what's there, explore there. I'm curious about what do we have there. I want to see what kind of uh, soldier upgrade path do they have. I want to see for these green guys as well. And I want to start my life there and build relationship with people there, not in this empire. Also, I wanted to see... There is some village I read in my uh, clan uh, options. They're here. My parents are from the place called uh, Chai Chaikand. 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 So I want to see where is this Chaikand place. You know, I want to see my homeland. So, let's check. Where is the Chaikand place? Chaikand, Chaikand. Is that some village here in the map or somewhere else? Maybe it's the part where I came from. Chaikand. Never mind. Let's check actually the part of the world I came from. It was near, near the training camp. Where was that? It was like here. Yes, near Poros. Yes. So is Chaikand over here? No. Never mind, maybe it's some off the map place. Still, I want to go to the Red Faction, to Valadians, because um, because of the because of the soldiers in the future, I will, let's say, uh, I will be able to build. Uh, maybe maybe the recruits can easily become horsemen and uh, more cheaply because these guys here I have, as you see in my inventory. These guys I have Vigla recruits that can become horsemen. They're actually pretty rare to find. They're not very common. I don't want to, let's say, play with infantry, upgrade them, spend money there to build an infantry army I, that's slow and then and then I can control and, and play with as I want or I'm, and as I'm good at. So that's why I want to go to this Red Kingdom. Also curious about what's, what else we have other than Empire. So... I wanted to see what can we recruit here. Just Imperial recruits and archers. And let's actually take a walk through this village. Why? Because we are leaving the Empire borders soon. And I simply want to see how their village looks like. I've, 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 we've seen some cities on the map. They do look different, have different architecture. So let's take a little walk around this village to see how it looks like. Uh, before we actually go somewhere else. We are we are able to showcase all the game to you, show you how the village look like, everything look like. So houses made of stone, red uh, roofs, rooftops. Isn't really orderly, doesn't look really like uh, prosperous. Okay, this is how the village look like. No any paved roads, just same similar houses. And it's kind of it. Little pastry village. Is this the elder or something? No, just a peasant. Oh, this horse jumps high. Who's this? A child? Child. Can I talk to the child? seems to be grown up person. Ah, you know what, never mind. Okay, that's it. Tiny, tiny little village. Doesn't really look nice if you ask me. 
let's leave this wretched place and let's explore new lands, new opportunities and new stuff. So let's leave here and let's see where else can we go. Let's go to, 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 to here. Let's see what kind of recruits can we get there. Tell me in the comments, I seem not to be able to find where is encyclopedia. I want to read who's the king, what's happening around. A little bit, I don't want to read it on, on a video here, I just... I will look for it later. Very seem to be looted. Maybe we won't be able to talk with anybody there. Oh, they produce iron ore. That's the iron mine or something. Oh, 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 okay. Recruit troops, imperial recruits, imperial recruits, imperial infantrymen, upgraded recruit. Okay. Basically, that's it. Okay. Products? Do you have iron ore? Can sell it pores for 74. Seems like a good deal. But I haven't came here for that. I haven't come. I haven't came here. I haven't come. I haven't come here. W whatever. I am not here for it. I'm here for something else. Let's go to this village. See what happens over there. So this is Empire Village, and this is like these Batanians. Yeah, Batanians like. Barbarian village or something. Yeah, it's looted, raided, nothing we can get there. Let's go to this one, see what they offer, what they sell. These guys, see what do they have? Let's talk about the news of the markets. She'll give you a tip. You just bought some Batanian Vormat from Sion on it, price of 860 to sell at Laget. Okay, cool. Yeah, these are Mongols, obviously. And uh, what products do you have? They have some horses, pretty expensive horses. They have some wine, iron ore, pottery, lots of stuff, and it's it's not very worthwhile to buy things here, obviously. Okay, so do they want to talk anymore? I want to talk more. Uh, I want to click here. This is encyclopedia. How do I get here? Home settlements. Home settlements, heroes. Oh, okay, but settlements. He has visited village, castle, town, culture. Actually, look at that. There are lots of different cultures. There is a Vlandia culture. And there is no my village here, the village where my, where my parents are from. There is Sturgia. Okay. Chornobus, Dvorusta. Have some kind of uh, Slavic names to it. Frigian. Horsgary. Larnak. Sound a little bit francophonic. Okay, these are definitely the Mongols. Empire. 
Greeks, Byzantine, Batania, Aster, Aster, Beglomwa, Bogbat, sounds even more francophonic maybe these are the kind of uh, francophonic Italian guys Aserai sounds let's see okay Arabic maybe Vakin secret step bandits no places sea raiders Nord Okay, mountain bandits, forest bandits, desert bandits, Darshi. Okay. So, heroes. Oosh. Lots of people around. Bandits. Okay, there is something about troops. Uh, we can see that in encyclopedia. Uh, okay, so okay. So let's actually check that right away. Vlandia units. Really, man? Let's start with recruit. How about that? So recruit can be upgraded to footman and footman to spearman, spearman to billman, vulgar pikeman. Or infantry, infantryman to light cavalry or swordsman, sergeant or vanguard. Yeah, this is probably something we would like to get. Or crossbowman. Okay, cool. Well, then pikeman. Pikeman? Ah, there you are. Okay. Sprout sapling arboreal. Look, it is some like archers. God. All right. What about you? Sturgia recruit. Sturgeon recruit. Okay. Well, they have sturgeon horse raider. They seem to be pretty good. They have archers and they have horsemen. Cool. And the Empire. Yeah, this have they have this and then this special kind of recruit can become horsemen, whatever. Okay, and Batanians, what about you guys? Volunteer, maybe? Basically, you can click anywhere. Oh, they have horsemen too. Mounted skirmisher. Look at this. This is kind of light horseman. Viddling. Falksman. Trained spearman. Okay, very, very well, very nice, pretty good. Okay, well, so far so good, carry on. Let's go to this village, see what can we get there. So let's see what recruits, Batanian volunteer. Let's recruit a few of them to see how the day Oh, these are like some Nordic looking guys. Look pretty different than our Greeks are there. Okay, let's. Two of them. Two of them, good enough. And. Uh, well, let's take a walk around. Let's see how different is this village. Where is the village? Uh, guys? 
Oh, there he's on there. happening here it looks like everything's like broken down to pieces there he goes okay let's leave Let's leave. And let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Well, let's try to go somewhere. Let's finally try to get somewhere here, you know. Try to get to... Maybe visit cities on the way, just to see the price. Let's go here and see the prices of stuff. If we're going to be honest, by the architecture and overall look empire definitely looks the most civilized which is to expect of course to be expected well others really look like they're less civilized more savage or something i mean look at this village and look at this village Look at this city, for example. It has much more of a look to it. Do go to trade, please. Keep arena tavern. There it is. So let's just check the prices just to know what our price is around. I'm gonna just glance over them because he will get a hint here that will say can buy, can sell, and so on. And let's continue our journey to our Valadian Empire. I guess going here to Sargot. Okay, so these Batanian guys and Empire are obviously in the war. And I thought these are Nords, actually they are not, these are the, these, uh, let's say, Slavic looking guys. I haven't really carted many bandits or whatever, so, oh, we don't have... Oh, we have lots of food, so it's just decreased a little bit. Castle. What's happening here? Let's get to this village as well. Forest bandits. Recruit. Imperial recruit. So this is Imperial village. Oh, okay. Vigla recruit. Okay, okay. What do you sell? Sheep, wool, cheese, all right. Wow, what a 
that desert. Charas, big trade city, I suppose. Looks nice. Let's go to Sargut. Do you want to fight? No. Let's do a little save game. There he goes. And finally, we are in our Red Kingdom. That's cool, that's nice. In Vlandia. So, Sargut is governed by their third king of Vladians. Vland Vlandians. Okay, looks like Flandria. Maybe it is that. The town is clearly going through hard times. Okay, so prosperity is falling. Issues, they have lots of issues. Loyalty, problem with loyalty, food shortage. Okay, garrison, food shortage. Only security is pretty high. There, tar, there, tar, there, tar. Uh, let's see what they trade. Velvet can buy it. Pecan for 122. Can sell it porous. Okay. Can buy there. Fur. Really? In Yalmaris, it's 51. Wow. And here I can sell it for like probably much more. Tools, hides, linen. So you see when you go to a few cities you just you just know the price is better. Okay, so kingdoms, I wanted to see that. Uh, neutral anime ally they're all neutral to me aserai these are the aserai so aserai are the yellow desert guys leaders is the unkid guy okay um honestly i don't think it's a good idea to read the encyclopedia in video if you demand it if you want me to read these and show these in a video tell me in the comment and i will do that in the next one Otherwise, I will read it like that off the screen. Let's just see the factions. Aserai, so these are deserts people, and these are main um, main clans and main cities. And these are wars, so they're in war with some. The Southern Empire and some other, like, guys over there. Okay, let's see other kingdoms. Batania. Batania, this is their leader. These are the main clans. These are main cities. And they are in war with Western Empire and these wolf skin guys. Okay. And uh, Vlandia. This is their leader. And these are the main, main like uh, main clans, and these are main, main fifths, main cities. And they're in war with Sturgia, with blue guys, and with Brotherhood of the Woods. I suppose there are some bandits or something. Okay, these guys here. So these empires generally are in war with somebody. All of them are in war with somebody. Well, Northern Empire. There it is, Lucan is their leader. These are the main 
main clans, main fifths, okay, and they wage lots of wars. And uh, Southern Empire, they just have a slightly different color, and they also wage lots of wars. And uh, Western Empire. Oh, they have different sign over there. This one have corn, Southern Empire. So I suppose the food is their mastery. They have a sword, so fighting is their mastery, I suppose. And Northern guys, I suppose ruling, peace, uh, democracy, whatever. Vlandia, oh, that's us. Us, I mean, ones I like. Sturgia. There's, there's some kind of Nordic Slavic guys, whatever. All right. Okay, this is all for kingdoms, clans. Oh, lots of clans here. Day Merok, Day Malern. Okay, and uh, they're also on Day. No, they're not. They're Fen. I see. Empire just words just names these guys just names two banu forest people nord okay And concepts. Okay, so enough of encyclopedia. I promise I'm not going to read it anymore. Again, if you want me to read everything and list everything in encyclopedia, you can request it in a video, but probably that's something you can find on the internet, not even in a video, some kind of uh, mountain blade wiki stuff, whatever. So I just wanted to make a short, to like shortly see what happens there. And let's hear maybe, let's recruit some people here first. So, Vlandian recruit, Vlandian footman, I guess, high level of this recruit, Vlandian Levi crossbowman, Levi crossbowman, Levi crossbowman recruit, so basically that's it they have. Let's take as much as we can, two of them, two of them, and let's go to the, let's see what we have in Smithy, well, same thing just we had before. Steel, 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 nothing different, nothing different, we're good. And then, 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 the trade, recruit, tavern, ransom your prisoners. You're in the back street. The local tavern seems to be attracted as usual crowd. Visit the tavern, ransom your prisoners, choose the prisoners. Oh, I can sell my prisoners. Okay. Good. And let's go to the tavern. So probably there is like a slave trader somewhere because I have this option offered to sell prisoners. Doesn't want to talk. Talk. Oh, I don't want to. He's probably just looking for a fight. Okay. Townsman, 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 townswoman, townsman. So look, this uh, this kind of inn looks much, much different than Imperial one. Uh, let's say much, looks much simpler, no way. We have a musician doing his thing. Kolek, blood axe. Okay, fighter, townsman, Vlandia townsman. Okay. Talking something, talking Jewish. Okay. Vlandia Townsman game host. Again, this guy with the game. But this is a different game, look at that. What game is this? Greetings, traveler. Do you know to play my muturere? I'm reckoned the master of the game, traditional pastime of the Vlandia. Okay, so that's a different game in Vlandia. Alright. Townsman. Da, 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 da. Some people talking. All 
right. Okay, have a good day, everybody. Okay, can we have a little talk, sir? No. Can't. Oh. We can. Cool. So, don't need anything. I need some information about the town. Can you tell me? Let's have some high society gossip. No. Regions dark underbelly. No. Rumors, markets. No. These tavern guys aren't really talkative. So, uh,. Anybody offers job? Sorgar, oil presser, mentioned something about needing someone to do some work. Alright, thank you. That would be it for now, kind sir. Keep doing your stuff. I'll be leaving you alone. Off with you. That's it, nothing much in the tavern. Just people having fun. Let's leave the place. Back to the town center, tavern district, arena. Oh, it's night, arena doesn't work, I suppose. Go to the keep, I have to pay. No. Take a walk around the center, but I don't want to do that in the evening. I would like to do it in the morning. So I'm actually going to wait around here a little bit. Okay, never mind, we can take a short walk around to see how it looks. As you see, it looks very, very different than Imperial Town. Not same, not even similar, but it looks beautiful in its own merit. This is some guy, and so on. Okay, actually, I was thinking of ending this episode here because it's late night here. I'm really tired. I I would like to go to sleep, and uh, in the next episode, I'm going to talk with some people around, get some job from some people around, and uh, get on uh, executing some quests, doing something, upgrading my clan. Everybody, thank you very much for watching. It was very nice showing these things to you. If you like the video, if you like the channel, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, please click the bell notification icon. Anything you want to comment, say, leave your comment in the comment section. And uh, if you need some extra coin, if you need to earn some money, if you need work, check out the link in the description. Uh, there you can apply to be an English teacher to Chinese and Japanese clients. It's pretty nice job offer, it's uh, pretty well paid, pretty easy job, not difficult. So check that out if you need it. Thank you very much for watching. See you in the next one. Have a good evening and bye-bye. Thank you.